What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Project 11 in today's video. I'm going to just be giving y'all my uh, opinion on um, you being a creator and your reality. And my opinion on creating your own reality. I want you to first start off by knowing the power of the law of attraction. We use the law of attraction every single day unconsciously. Some of us know, some of us don't know. But we use the law of attraction every day. It's one of the laws of the universe. We constantly attract what we think about. Oh, I'm going to be late. I'm going to be late. Dang it, I'm not going to be on time. And guess what happens? You end up being late. Because you're sending that vibration out into the universe. And you attract that. You attract more traffic. <laughs> might take the wrong turn. Might, you know what I'm saying? But understand the power of the law of attraction. Look into the law of attraction. Because this is first going to help you understand the power of manifesting your reality. And understanding the law of attraction. Once you understand the law of attraction, you can begin to use it to your advantage and create this reality. Create a world. Create your own world in this reality. Manifest anything you want. Simple. In understanding the law of attraction, you understand that you have to first ask. You first, I mean, you first have to ask. Second, you have to believe. Third, you have to receive. Understand your power. Understand how powerful your mind is. It's just the government has dumbed us down so we don't think for ourselves, so we don't notice this power within ourselves. So, how are you able to create your own reality? Understand that you write the script in your life. Whatever situation that you are in at the moment is because you put yourself there. You, nobody else. Who is in control of your life? You are. Who's in control of what you think? You are. So if you know that you are in control of your life and you know that you are in control of what you think, you can use that to your advantage. You are where you are because of who you are. And if you are going to get somewhere else, you're going to have to change something. So change your belief system. Beliefs run, rule our reality. Rule what we manifest. Your belief system. So if you believe that you can't manifest, if you believe that you can't create your reality, if you believe that you will be stuck forever in whatever situation that you are in, then that's what you're going to, that's what the universe is going to reflect back to you. You have to believe that you are powerful enough to change your reality. You have to believe that you can manifest whatever it is that you want to manifest. Your thoughts are energy. And so is everything around you. There's this quote, there's, well, there's this saying that Big Sean said, if you want a pair of shoes, they are at the store. It's not like them shits ain't out there. It's not like them shit don't exist. They are actually at the store. Let me say it again. I'm going to say it again. If you want a pair of shoes, they are at the store. 
It's not like they don't exist. So whatever it is that you want to manifest, the life that you want to manifest is already out there. It is already out there. It's not like it doesn't exist. It's just a matter of attracting it to you, being in that vibration, tapping into that vortex, tapping into that vibration. So first ask yourself, do you believe that you can have the life that you want? Yes. Do you believe that you are a master manifester? Yes. Do you believe that your beliefs shape reality? Yes. Okay. Do you believe that you write the script? Yes. Writing the script as in you control where you are in your life. Nobody else writes the script but you. Can't nobody tell you who you can and can't.